As I already mentioned, the renal replacement therapies include dialysis and transplant. If we consider hemodialysis, hemodialysis is a process where the patient's blood is removed, it is processed in a machine and it is returned back to the body. The basic principle is diffusion, where the patient's blood is exposed to a specially created fluid against a semi-permeable membrane. So the unwanted uh, waste product from the patient's blood is removed in the dialysate and the processed purified blood is returned to the patient. This takes, each process takes about 4 hours and uh, a recommendation internationally is about 12 hours of dialysis per week. For hemodialysis, we require an access from when, where we can remove the blood from the patient's body and return it to the body. These access, the best access is an AV fistula. Alternative accesses can be catheters, but they are best avoided. In peritoneal dialysis also, the principle is of diffusion. But here, the semi-permeable membrane is the body's own membrane, which is known as the peritoneum. A specially created fluid, which is put into the abdomen of the patient, and it stays there for a pre-specified duration of time. And this is exposed to the blood in the peritoneal capillaries, where the exchange process takes place, and the blood of the patient is purified. Peritoneal dialysis is more physiological because it is a 24-hour process and it mimics the physiology of the kidneys to a very close extent. Kidney transplant is a surgical process where a healthy matched kidney is placed into the groin of the patient. Kidney transplant can replace both the endocrine and metabolic functions of the kidney and it is the best suited renal replacement therapy for all patients. Kidney transplant uh, initially there were barriers of blood group but nowadays the barriers of blood group and HLA have been overcome so the uh, availability of kidney transplant has also increased. The uh, immunosuppressant medicines have to be taken lifelong to man maintain the good function of the kidneys.